guys, it is Natalie. Welcome back to my channel, Living the Oil Life. If you missed our video yesterday, we are changing things up a little bit and instead of Did You Know Friday, we are going to be doing Let's Talk Thursday. And today we are kicking off that series with Giving Back. Now, I love being part of Young Living Essential Oils and I really don't need any more reasons uh, to be part of such an amazing company, but I love the fact that Young Living gives back. Not only do they give back uh, to nature when they cultivate and distill and things like that by replanting and replenishing the earth, they also love to give back to the community. And there are several different ways that they do that. And one of those ways is that they partner, partner with different organizations that are dedicated to educating the public about the versatile uses and the profound effects that essential oils have on the body and mind. And some of those organizations include Ola, which of course is an amazing or organization. If you have not heard of them, make sure you look them up. Um, but Ola actually helps to find balance in an unbalanced world. Uh, they collaborated with Young Living in what is called Infused, and that is to help you engage in all five senses uh, to help in seven key areas in your life. So that's just one of the organizations. Another one is called the Tibetan TB Project, which I had, which I had never heard about. But apparently, the Tibetan, they um, did a study and found that the Tibetan refugees are actually one of the populations that has the highest rate of tuberculosis. And so Young Living has partnered with the Tibet, Tibetan TB Project. They help to provide essential oils, diffusers, and thief products to the Tibet, Tibetan refugees, which I think is amazing. Um, and then there is the You Can Thrive Foundation, which is dedicated to providing free and and low cost support services and long time survivorship tools to breast cancer survivors. And then there's the Urban Zen Foundation, which aims to change the current healthcare paradigm to include integrative medicine and promote patient advocacy. And then the, another one that Young Living partners with is the Beth Israel Medical Center. And it is to help issues commonly suffered by oncology patients with alternative modalities like aroma therapy. So those are just a couple of organizations that Young Living partners with to give back to the community and to give back to the world. And if you want to learn more about those organizations, you can actually go to our virtual office and in the member resources, you can look it up and it's in partnerships. And it gives a description of all of of those. It gives the contact information of how you can get involved with each of those um, organizations. But one of my favorite ways that Young Living gives back is the Young Living Foundation. Now, the Young Living Foundation was formerly known as the D. Gary Young Foundation. And I think what happened was a lot of people kind of misunderstood what it was and weren't quite sure what it was. And I think they thought that they were kind of just giving back to D. Gary Young. And they, you know, kind of thought, well, he's, you know, part of Young Living and when we, you know, buy our products, we are giving back to him also. Um, so I think they're kind of rebranding it because the D. Gary Young Foundation isn't just, it is run by him, it is his foundation, but it only is maintained by the donations that we give and the and how much participation Young Living members and other people, you don't have to be a distributor of course, but mostly Young Living members give back into this foundation is how well we can help support those around us. So I wanted to read you what the company overview says. It, but it says, formerly known as the D. Gary Young Foundation, the Young Living Foundation has become a powerful vehicle for empowering individuals to defy human limitations throughout the world. Over the years, the foundation has evolved into the primary avenue through which Young Living Essential Oils demonstrates its commitment to serving, to serving families and communities worldwide. As chairman of the board, Young Living founder D. Gary Young assists the foundation with his lifelong passion for helping to improve the lives of people everywhere. The Young Living Foundation is dedicated to changing lives with greater impact than ever before. Young Living's vision is to have Young Living essential oils in every home across the world. And when we say every home, we mean every home. The Young Living Foundation plays a major role in bringing Young Living essential oils into homes and communities in the developing world. And this is why I love the Young Living Foundation. 
Not only are they passionate about getting Young Living Essential Oils and oil products in all the homes, they are passionate about impacting the world around them. A couple of things that I wanted to mention that the Young Living Foundation does is that their orphanage is in Croatia. There is also a Young Living Academy in Ecuador, and that offers students an American standard education preparing each one to become a prominent contributing citizen in their community. And so Young Living is not only offering them a great education, but it is teaching them how to be a prominent citizen to give back to their community, which I think is huge. Uh, they also partner with African Hearts Community Organization, which is helping to construct a nursery school for 200 children. Another organization that the Young Living Foundation helps to pour into is Soul Hope, S-O-L-E Hope and this is one of my favorite things and their vision is offering hope healthier lives and freedom from foot related diseases through education jobs and medical relief they are trying to rid the world of jiggers and to bring hope to those children and those communities that are affected by these diseases that jiggers bring it is an amazing organization and they are actually um, the founders are actually Young Living Distributors. So make sure you definitely check that one out. It is S-O-L-E, hope, soul, hope. And another way that the Young Living Foundation gives back is that they provide service trips. As a Young Living Distributor, you can actually go on a service trip, kind of like a missions trip, where you can go and it says that you can uh, take, park, take part hands-on with the Young Living Foundation to make a difference. And in March, you can go to Uganda and not only improve the homes of the students who go to the Young Living Academy, uh, but you will have the privilege to celebrate the first graduation, graduating senior class of the Young Living Academy. And what's really cool about the graduation is that 100% of the students in the senior class are graduating. So those are just a few of the ways that Young Living gives back to the community. And that's why I love being part of this company. I just think it's amazing how much they give back. It's not just about selling oils. It's not just about producing the best product. Uh, I believe in the world, but it's about giving back to the community wherever you may be. You can give back by helping to donate to the Young Living Foundation, and there's a couple of ways that you can do that. Um, of course, you don't need to be a distributor to give a donation, but you should be a Young Living um, Wholesale member. Everyone should be, but you don't have to be. But as a Young Living Wholesale member, you can actually have your order rounded up to the nearest dollar, and that amount will be given to the Young Living Foundation. And then there's also a part in that same section, um, and I'll show you, and uh, here's a picture of it, that you can actually um, put an amount when, when you place your order to be given to the Young Living Foundation. And what I really love about the Young Living Foundation is that unlike a lot of other um, organizations, 100% of your donation actually goes to where it is needed because the administrative cost is actually absorbed by Young Living. So all of your donation goes back, goes into the Young Living uh, Foundation, whereas a lot of um, organizations only part of it. Sometimes it's 75, uh, sometimes it's 80, sometimes it's a lot less than that. Um, goes towards the actual foundation and then the rest of it goes towards the administrative cost. But with Young Living, 100% of that administrative cost is taken care of. So our donations go right where they need to go, which I think is really And then cool. another way you can give back is you can hold your own fundraiser to um, make donations to give to the Young Living Foundation. And I know a lot of uh, Young Living distributors have done that before. And that would be something kind of cool to do with your team is to think of a fun way to raise donations to give to the Young Living Foundation. And one of the ways I'm gonna give back, hopefully at the beginning of the year, when I get everything in order, is you can actually sponsor a child from the Young Living, from the Young Living Academy. You can sponsor one of the students. And I believe it's $75 a month. We're in contact with that student constantly. And if uh, you get to go on one of the trips, you can actually visit that child at the Young Living uh, Academy, which I would love to do that. But I am planning on sponsoring a child, hopefully at the beginning of the year. And if you get a commission check, you can actually have your commit. You can ha actually have uh, that um, sponsorship 
automatically deducted from your commission check, which I think is pretty cool. But that would be a great project for your kids if your kids get allowance, um, if they wanna work for extra um, chores and things like that to make that money every month. That would be a really great service project for them and that's their way to give back to their community and give back to their world in a small way. So that is it for Let's Talk Thursday. We were talking about giving back. I hope this prompted you guys a little bit to think about how can you give back to the community if you aren't already, or if you're like me and you can't physically go on trips, you can't physically um, go away um, and do those amazing uh, things that the Young Living Foundation does, you can give back monetarily, or you can give back by arranging a fundraiser event, and you can give back that way. Um, there's little ways that we each can give back uh, so that we can impact the world just a little bit to make it the bigger picture even better. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video a little bit. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet. And if it's your first time joining us and you are wondering about Young Living and what it's all about and you would love to talk more, please contact me. All of my information is in the description box below and I would love to hear from you. I hope you guys have a rest, a great rest of the week. As always, keep living the oil life and I'll see you guys later. Bye.